Here's a note to the Indiana State Highway Department about construction on Indiana 61. It's a major connector in southern Indiana. It goes from Monroe City to Petersburg. But now there's construction at Petersburg, and sadly the detour is a long one. Up to Washington, and then west over to Wheatland on Highway 50, And finally, at Wheatland, left on Indiana 241 down to Monroe City to join the original right-of-way. But there's a problem right here. If you're coming in from Washington toward this rural intersection where speeds are pretty high, the only time you see a sign is right at the intersection to turn left. But what if you're in the right-hand lane? You need to scoot all the way across traffic. There needs to be a sign here. And maybe while we're thinking about it, a little more advanced warning. Maybe one a little bit farther out. So if you're barreling through following a truck, you know you need to go left on 241 to complete the bypass. And then in Monroe City, there is yet another problem. As you approach the intersection, there's a sign there that tells you that the detour is over, but points you to the left. Now, if you go to the left, what happens? Well, you wouldn't know this if you lived out of town, but you end up at the closing sign and the detour, and it tells you to go left, and left is right back where you came from. So what do you do at that point? Shouldn't that sign actually look like this? Or better still, look like this? Because who needs to know that the old road to the left is the old road and it's now closed? You need to go straight ahead at this point and look farther down at the intersection itself. This sign should look like this. Well, I guess if you live here, you know where you are. But if you're going through as a tourist or someone from out of town, you could be out of luck. Thanks for watching this. I'm Dennis Daly.